Dante the most about this 37th par- parallel and the mutilation thing is that it is spooky. It, it's it's weird. There is actually no concrete evidence as to what is happening to it. Um, the weird thing about the mutilation of these um, of the genitals and organs on these cattle and things like that is that it's clean cuts. So it's not like I looked it up. I was like, They're surgical, well, this has right? to be wolves or something. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, this has to be wolves or something. I was like, what do wolves eat first? And wolves do go for the animals and predators in general go for organs, genital organs, large organs first. But the cuts on the animals are like, they're like slices. It's like someone went into it with a knife. So right now, the current best explanation is that it's satanic. And like uh, a lot of these align with like full moons and stuff like that. So a lot of people go out and commit like other people's animal sacrifices on these days. But I will say that to me, this is another one of those big, like what the heck is going on things? Because just to say that tens of thousands of cattle deaths are just satanic, crazy hooligans going out and committing satanic rituals or sabotaging farm owners, killing each other's cows that doesn't do enough to explain to me what's happening to them. I think we're getting so, to another conspiracy, which is the chupacabra. <laughs> well, people, that that is, that's not even. Are you serious about that? Because that is something <laughs> they were talking about in the I'm news sure, article. I'm sure. Because a lot of it, that New Mexico is in the 37th parallel zone as well, and that was happening a lot there. And La Llorona is in there. So that so they say is that the crying witch, cl- oh, crying widow. mother who yeah, yeah crying. Witch. That was a movie we couldn't stop laughing at. Yeah. yeah. Wow, spooky. But we're Ooh. not on the 37th parallel here, just Southern Colorado. But um, I love the idea of a, a healthy satanic population performing rituals. That's true. Like, good to hear they're all out there thriving and practicing religion. Um, that's got to be good. 